uh, you know what starts out like a tummy ache when you think maybe you've got food poisoning or you think of something you've suffered before. I did not think beyond that. That was the beginning of a two-month stay in hospital from the intensive care unit to the high dependency unit with acute pancreatitis, which Louis was lucky to walk out of alive. I was all wired up and all taped up and it was tubes and, and I was in a laboratory for all I know. In this note, I asked Louis whether the doctors found out what caused his pancreas to flare up. That's the first time I had a doctor saying he's got to stop drinking. You know, this is just alcohol. Now these are doctors around my bed and they're having this conversation. <laughs> and I'm thinking, who is going to explain this? Well, I, have, I don't have a drink problem. They never actually told me this particular thing crushed the pancreas. He made it out, only to be back in about eight months. I immediately went into a very bad depression. Uh, I just sunk. My spirit sunk. Everything sunk. One morning, I wake up, and I can't hear the nurse. I was in shock. How do you wake up one morning and it's gone? Louis' world fell silent, and nobody knew why. I lost the world. In one single day, I lost the world. End up with a hearing aid. But what it did, it opened up noise. I could pick up all the noise around me, but I could not discern speech. That was not the only problem. All of a sudden, I cannot walk a straight line. Very basic thing, like standing in the shower, became a risk. You've got to put a stool in there. Why am I falling down in the house? I have a scar. Three pairs of hearing aids later, I try to read their lips when they're talking. My daughter comes from school. I can't hear my daughter. Every day. It's painful. People that were his friends vanished. Nobody's going to touch you. Nobody's going to be with you. Nobody visits. Nobody calls. Nobody tries to check up on you. President Uhuru Kenyatta has made a promise. Louis Otieno, who was at one time one of the most sought-after TV personalities in the country, worked at KTN, KBC, K24, and Citizen TV stations. He was a celebrated interviewer and ran memorable shows such as Newsline, Louis Otieno Live, and This is Louis. He says his doctors have told him he needs electronic implants inserted in his cochlea, the inner part of the ear responsible for detecting sounds. One of the things I hope for if I get my implants is get my body balance back. And if I get that, I can get out. If I get out, I can go back and help and work and become productive again. Dr. Masi Korir, KT News. And a very